Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Joey here again with yet another wig review and I'm finally back. I'm so happy to be back with you guys. I just had my baby and you know a lot of things are about to change. So my scheduling is about to change when it comes to posting videos and also the format of how I record some of my videos because as you guys know I like to show you guys how I customize my wigs. But some of them, I will not be doing that in the video just because of my timing and, you know, the baby being around. Sometimes I'll be home alone, so I won't have enough time just because I have to tend to her and all of that. So bear with me, you know, but I will still be bringing you guys wig reviews regardless of what format I decide to choose to do the video in. You guys will still get the information that you need on every wig that I try so let's get started so first of all I want to thank I want to thank so good BB for sending me this wig to review for you guys I don't know why I'm running out of breath because I'm not pregnant anymore so I shouldn't be running out of breath but I'm just so excited to be back but yeah so good BB was kind enough to send me this hair to review for you guys and this wig is from Vivica A Fox and just in case if you guys didn't know she has a line um, the, the wig that I'm wearing is Ariel, that's the style name, and the color that I'm wearing is 1B. And this is from the Natural Baby Hair Swiss Lace Front Wig Collection. It says that it has a silky soft Swiss lace, which is an invisible, um, lace. And it's also safe to heat up to 392 degrees. And let me see what else. She does come in other different colors if you guys are interested. Um, let me show you guys the length of this wig. So the length is pretty much just 18 inches. Keep in mind, I am short, so everything does look like a lot longer on me. I am 5 feet tall to be exact. And this is the sides. Excuse my bra, guys, because I just wanted to look cute for this video, but I'm not going anywhere. This is the back. Just so you guys can see if there's no wefts showing or anything like that. This is the side. And that is about it. So, wig cap construction, you do get three combs. You get two on the sides right here. And you also get one in the back. And you also get an adjustable strap. The texture on this hair is kind of like a yakky texture, I want to say. I did get some shedding with this hair. Um, especially when I was plucking at the parting space, which this, that's the only alteration that I did to this wig, by the way. I plucked the parting space and I put a little bit of powder on it. I didn't really do much because I feel like this wig does not need that much work. But what I should have done though, right here, I didn't glue, as you can see, I didn't glue it on, but I should have put a little bit of powder right here because I just feel like you can see the difference between my skin tone and the lace even though the lace is invisible you can kind of see that a little bit so I should have put some powder there but I did put some powder up here well the whole parting space and I did plug some of the parting space so let's get into what I think about this wig so first of all um I like the texture I'll say that. I like the lens. I like the curls. The curls are cute. Um, I didn't get like a lot of shedding, like running my fingers through it. I just got shedding from customizing and kind of brushing through it. When you do brush through it, you are gonna get some shedding. Um, there was no tangling. It was a very it's a very smooth unit. And this is my first time wearing this unit. It's out the box. Um, and it did come with some with some lace, but I did cut that off. Um, because I didn't show you guys how I customized it. Um, but my biggest con with this wig is the structure of the wig itself. So the inside, the cap construction is very weird. So when you open it, it looks like it expands a lot. But if you actually try to kind of pull the wig to see if it has flexibility, it does not have that much flexibility at all which makes it difficult because if you have a, a larger head it's not going to fit as snug and honestly i had to watch another youtube video for me to see 
like what was going on with this wig and somebody else had recorded a, a review because nobody else has recorded a review for this wig i mean by now probably there's more but at the time when i watched it the person was saying that it wasn't big head friendly now i'm small headed and i had difficult putting on this wig the reason was because i put the adjustable strap on and it kept popping off so that was getting on my last nerve so after about like the fourth or fifth try I put it on and I had to put the adjust the adjustable strap on first and then take the comb and put it on so that it would snug on and the comb is not even on in the back I could even show you guys I'm not even lying to y'all y'all can see my hair right here well not my hair but you can see the wig cap with a little bit of my hair and right here is the comb it's it's not even on it's not even on i don't know what's going on with that but it does not have any flexibility even for somebody that's small headed and i understand i have a lot of hair but i can still be able to put on a lot of my wigs so that was a little bit frustrating in my opinion um, I was not feeling that at all and I feel like if that's a problem the way that the wig sits itself is going to be an issue period so you guys know I don't like saying anything negative about wigs or anything like that but I'm going to tell you the truth so that's just the only thing that I'm going to say with this wig I'm not feeling that whole thing the parting space is cool I'm not crazy about it because I'm not a side part kind of girl but I know what I was signing up for when I ordered this wig, so I'm not really tripping off of it. Um, it's workable and it's easy to customize, so I don't have an issue with it. And I just think that if the infrastructure was just fine, you know, if the infrastructure was um, easier to work with, with the wig, this wig would be gorgeous. Like, I feel like she would be an easy slay. She'll be perfect for the holidays. Or anything like that but everybody's experience might be different so maybe if you order this wig it might be different for you so if you guys do end up getting this wig I will be putting the link below where you guys can purchase this wig of course but if you end up getting it let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below because it might just be me I might just be the only person having problems with it but I just was not feeling the whole the way it was what it was doing inside like I just wasn't feeling it and that was just my opinion so let me know what you guys think in the comments below don't forget to subscribe of course before you guys leave my channel and don't forget to also hit that bell so you guys get notifications on when i'm dropping a new video and of course go ahead and follow me on instagram at peralta knows best thank you for watching guys i hope you guys have a safe and wonderful holiday with your family and friends i will see you guys soon bye